After months of preparation, a final decision has been made. Last night, the Small Harbor Management Strategy Project held its last meeting in Ontonagon. ABC 10's Chelsea Snyder has reaction from the meeting. The village of Ontonagon was one of the four communities in Michigan to be selected for the Sustainable Small Harbor Management Strategy Project. Meetings and preparations for the project have been underway since last fall, and Monday night, residents of the area gathered to hear the final design concept. What the team did was look for some themes in the input that uh, we gathered and uh, look for those key themes that, that uh, seem to resonate with the most people and seem to make sense um, here in, in 2016. Some of the key themes from the final design concept include improving access to the water and beach area on Rose Island and better connections in town. Well, some of the things that uh, we really need to, to focus on in the future is focus on our waterfront whether it's uh, along the river and water trails or along the lake shore and uh, improving access to Lake Superior and the beach and making more use of our uh, water recreation resources that we have here in town. It's an opportunity for not just uh not just tourism and, and the Porcupine Mountains and everything that we have to offer here as far as recreations, but also from a shipping standpoint and from an industrial standpoint, when you see this and you look at it, you say, wow, there's just so much. Hundreds have attended the various meetings and shared their visions and dreams for the village surrounding the waterfront. Residents of the area are very excited for the project to finally start taking place. I think that Antonagon has had its share of difficulty in the last 20 years. We've lost our copper mine. We've lost our uh, paper mill, and a lot of people have moved out, and the people that are here uh, are survivors. We've stayed here, and we believe in this place, and this is the beginning of our next 20 years here in Antonagon, and we're, um, we're looking forward to it. Reporting for ABC 10 and the CW5, I'm Chelsea Snyder.